Hello, oh, so episode three here on Aber Gay God. Just back from a night out. Before I went out tonight, I was in to see the latest Batman film, and it was a hell of a emotional roller coaster ride. Eight out of ten. Long film, but by God, the most fitting of all climaxes. Um, Batman lived. And I had one of the happiest birthdays I can remember. Oops. Thought I'd give a proper review to SummerSlam 2015. That moment when they both sat up and uh, Brock Lesnar rather is doing that laugh like he always does when he imitates The Undertaker. And The Undertaker sits up and he's like, I didn't know who to cheer for during this match. Before going into it, I was one Brock Lesnar to win. I think it's his time. The Undertaker has nothing more to prove. He doesn't need to go over. Um, but during the match, I, I found myself like, a cheer for both awesome. That's what it's all about. And uh, yeah, those two are made for each other. One of my favourite celeb icons of all time. There's him. Good old Roger Moore. Rest in peace, you fucking legend. Maybe I shouldn't. I shouldn't. I should try and stop swearing, but I um this if there was any one celeb I would tell young people to look up to it was um, Roger Moore. I think he was a gem. I had the privilege of seeing him just six months ago um, when he came to Aberdeen, and uh, just what a gentleman, what an inspiration, and he done a lot of good work. Um, to help others over the years and I will always, always uh, look up to Sir Roger Moore. Fears conquered. Despite the result, last night was a big personal milestone for me and I think we've got a great chance of uh, getting Rangers where they belong, back on top. 